In this video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to enter purchase invoices in Xero. Okay, let me show you how to input your purchase invoices in Xero. In Xero, they're referred to as bills. From our dashboard, we've got three options. We can scroll down to the bills you need to pay area and we can click on new bill. Or we can click on the big plus sign and then we can choose bill. Third option, we can go to accounts, purchases, new and then bill. Okay, let's look at example one of a bill that we're going to input. We've got a bill here, it's from Colin the Computer Geek and it's for £100 plus VAT. So let's go ahead and input it. So we're on the from section and we're just going to key in Colin the Computer Geek. Now because it's new, we've got select new contact, the invoice date 1st of September, due date, we're going to use our shortcut because it's due in 30 days time. The invoice reference is 480 and the invoice value is £120. Description, computer consultancy, quantity 1, price 100 an accounts code, let's look for if there's something that says IT. No, we don't want IT software and consumables. Let's see if there's a consultancy code. Consultant, we're happy with that. We're a VAT register business and there's VAT on this invoice. So it's going to, we're going to choose 20% VAT on expenses. Again, if you're not a VAT register business, all your tax rate amounts would show as no VAT and you would input the invoice as £120. Once we're happy with what we've input, we can just have a quick check on the screen, call in the computer geek. There's the date, the due date, the reference number, computer consultancy, where we have coded it. And we're just going to go straight to the green approve. If we went to the blue save, that would save it as draft and then we could review it later. But we're happy with this, so we're just gonna to go to approve. Now we're gonna look at a second example, and this time we've got an invoice from Andy, the awesome accountant, and it's for 500 pounds plus VAT. So let's go and input. From Andy, the awesome accountant, date, 1st of September, due date, again, use the shortcut, plus 30, reference, 500, value of the invoice, £600. Description, accountancy is fine, quantity 1, unit price, £500. Where do we want to code it? Let's see if there's an accountancy code. Audit and accountancy fees, we're fine with that. Again, VAT 20% because there's VAT on that invoice. If you were not VAT registered, this would be no VAT and you'd be input in the total. The amount is tax exclusive because we input £500 and zero adds 100 Once we're happy with that invoice, everything that's entered on the screen, we're okay with, we just click the green approve. And that's how you input your purchase invoices.